everyone, welcome back on my channel. In this video I'm gonna show you the new Dior palette from Powerlook collection, the next autumn collection from Dior. I took it on Dior website, it's now available so you can have a look. It's beautiful and this logo is also impressed on the palette itself. I choose the Glorify because I love the cool tones, I always love cool tones for makeup on myself. It's a beautiful range of cool violet, I think they work brilliant with Hazel Eyes. So many deep colors uh, with the palette next to come from different brands and now that summer maybe we don't uh, consider this uh, range of colors so it was uh, an art choice in this period and uh, so let's see this uh, palette inside I open I'll show you as you can see there is a very beautiful violet shade at first impression I thought it was a lilac, instead it's a beautiful amethyst. Then there is this silver that uh, is a gunmetal shade. And this very deep violet, a beautiful ivory with a hit of pink. And this pastel light blue. Now I swatch it, uh, as you can see there is this pastel light blue, a deep violet shade, a ivory shade, amethyst and this beautiful grey that turns to blue silver shade. I love this shade, it's a gum metal shade. I bought two eyeshadow from latest Chanel collection to have the shade that's blue grey and this is very beautiful so I already create my makeup and I let you see this palette in action about texture they seem to be a satin texture except for deep violet and the parcel light blue that seem to be matte so I'm taking the ivory shade it's a very luminous shade it's an ivory with a hint of pink, in my opinion. So this is the first shade. Then I take the shade. I say the lilac, but uh, when I apply it, it's a real amethyst. It's very light. This is metallic, satin metallic. I love the shade because it's a cool light violet. And I applied this matte deep violet. I imagine also a beautiful smoky eyes with this hint of violet uh, from amethyst to deep violet. This is definitely um matte shade you can build the the shadow to give more intensity to your um, to your eyes i 
I think it could be perfect also under the eye. This applicator is very good for applying liner under the eye. If you get it, use it because it's very precise for applying eyeshadow. I apply a little touch of this grey shade This is a beautiful grey because you can really use it alone but also with the violet in my opinion but you have to be you have to pay attention because it can change your your violet. Now I take the light blue with my finger. And then I blend. Now I put this base of eyeshadow. I put my eyeliner. For this occasion, I use my Dorshawn Stage Liner. I really love this liner. I already talked about it. There is a video a link here. In my opinion, this is a very good eyeliner because it's very thin. It got this rigid tip and uh, it's very precise. To complete my look, I didn't buy the new Dior Addict shade because I would like to see in person. So I put a um, color on my lips uh, that in my opinion is similar to a shade from this Dior range and I think it could work well with this makeup. This is a blush from uh, Stay Matte from Rimmel. It's, um, it's a matte pink shade, cool tone. I also added a little bit of violet pencil in my waterline. So this is the look. I hope you enjoyed my video, thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and follow me also on Instagram. Thank you, bye!